Money transfer apps are rapidly replacing checking accounts these days, especially for people who don't want to handle cash during a pandemic. But as consumer reporter John Mattery shows us, these apps also make things much simpler for scammers, as one local woman found out. Many people these days are dumping their bank accounts for money transfer apps on their phones. Unfortunately, these apps are easy targets for scammers, as one Madisonville woman just learned. Corinthia, who asked that we not use her last name, just saw her monthly rent money and more disappear in a flash when a scammer got access to her Cash App account. So it began with a, uh, an email to me and it said $499 was going to be withdrawn from my account. Worried, she called the phone number in the email and got a friendly phone agent. He told me to download this app so he could look into my account. But that friendly agent was not really with Cash App. As soon as she opened the Cash App for him to see, he transferred $1,600 to someone in Canada. And $4 is what left in my Cash App account now. With so many of these scams, it turns out the victim inadvertently called the scammer thinking they were with Cash App, then gave the person their account number or let them remotely take control of their phone. Earlier this summer, Mark Fisher Googled Cash App customer service, called them, and had his account drained by a scammer. And then I got hung up on $3,400 in this. More than $3,000 gone in a second. Cash App now states on its website, please note there are currently no phone numbers that you can call to speak with cash support. No one representing Cash App will ever ask for your signing code. We contacted Cash on the chance they can help Corinthia recover her money. $1,600, that's a month's pay for me. Remember, money transfer apps are convenient, but don't have FDIC insurance or a bank's protections. So always don't waste your money. I'm John Matteris, WCPO 9 News.